Okay, what I'm doing is, is I'm going to be opening the paper lift motor that I have uh, taken out of a copy machine. Basically, it's a cassette paper lift motor. Um, it's 24 volts DC the motor is, but I will be using uh, a different power source. I won't be using 24 volts DC because uh, the ball does not need to turn quickly to extract the oil. You want it to turn slowly. So what I will be doing is, is I have a small power supply that's actually 14 volts DC. I will be using that to power it. Um, and, and the reason why, again, is, is because I, I want it to go slow. I don't want it to go fast. And that's all I needed to do is, is go slow. So I will be taking it apart. Try to do this with one hand here. So I have the paper lift motor apart now. Um, and what I need to do is, is what I'm going to do is uh, I will drill a hole. Um, I'll drill a hole right in the back here somewhere. And then, uh, so I can feed my wires through there because I'm going to hard solder the wires right to the, um, the motor. So if I pull this out, you can see that I'm going to pull this out. Right here is the motor. And I will actually hard solder it right to these contacts here. Oops. Let's see these contacts right here. So I have a positive and a negative contact. And what I'll do is, like I said, I'll solder it right to those connections. And then uh, I won't put a switch on it. There's no need to. If When I need to use it, I'll just plug it in the wall. Um, so what I'm going to do is now is um, I'm going to pause this video and then I'm going to uh, solder it and then I'll be back.